NFL, in its infinite wisdom, has turned the schedule release into a huge event. Tomorrow at 8 o'clock, um, everybody will know who they are playing, when they are playing, are they in prime time. Uh, which games do you think, um, which ones are you looking forward to? Which ones do you think end up in prime time? Um, and, and what do you think it, it awaits the Browns as far as how many prime time games? Yeah, so I think when it comes to what I'm looking forward to personally, I, I'm super excited for the division games they have against the Ravens and the Bengals. I, I just think it's going to be obviously a totally different landscape this year. I think we've seen the Browns defense matches up really well with that Bengals offense. They're kind of built to defend the pass. Uh, so those are some exciting games. Obviously, you have Tom Brady and the Bucks coming to town this year. So that's certainly uh, exciting and has plenty of storylines there lined up. I mean, big, when you talk about big marquee games going to Buffalo this year, that's going to be a huge one. So, um, you know, when looking at how many primetime games they might have, I think the Baltimore game in Baltimore is certainly a candidate. That's one that we saw uh, the last couple of years, actually. And I just think the atmosphere that they put on down there is is truly phenomenal. I think one of the Bengals games could easily be a candidate for a primetime game if it's not immediately on the schedule, maybe a flex game later in the year. Um, at Pittsburgh versus the Steelers, um, that's certainly a candidate. That Buffalo game might be a candidate. There are a handful of games, maybe like four or five games, I think, that you could easily see in primetime or, or flexed to primetime if it, if it goes that way. But I, I just think the AFC North has so many storylines this year, and good quarterback play and it, it just was such a wonky division last year and injuries played such a factor in everything so I think for me those are still like the marquee matchups on the schedule for me and I'm curious to see how backloaded the schedule is with division games because last year all the Browns division games were played week eight and onward so I'm very curious if that is a similar thing this year, or if they get a division game, if it's snuck in maybe slightly earlier this year. Yeah, and there's, um, you know, the AFC is loaded with really good quarterbacks. So that'll be, you know, they play Justin Herbert, you got Josh Allen. So it, yeah. th those will be very interesting to see.